Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am back with some championship predictions for game week 7. And uh, let us start off by introducing myself. My name is Teddy and I support Everton if you haven't seen my, uh, a video of mine before. And let us dive straight into the fixtures. Um, and I have looked at the fixtures um earlier today and they do look they, they well they do look juicy i have seen well well i've got them written down on my ipad so uh so my prediction so i'll go through them in a minute with you but let's start off with the first match shall we and the first match is uh plymouth argyle against luton town and let's start off with plymouth shall we they are the home team we will start off with plymouth and it was a 1-0 defeat for them against West Bromwich Albion. And, um, yeah, look, it was a match where you would expect them to lose. But fair play to Plymouth for losing by one goal, um, is what I must say. They are up against Luton Town and it doesn't get much easier for them. Luton Town, they won 2-1 against 10 men Sheffield Wednesday, which we will talk about in a bit. Um, but for this first match, I am feeling uh, Luton Town win here. Plymouth Argyle 1, Luton Town 2. And the next match is Derby County against Norwich City. Uh, two teams who, um, well, Derby County, let's, talk, let's start off by talking about them. They are at home. Derby County, they um, lost to Sheffield United 1-0 last week. Um, but I mean they are at home and you can't write them off at home you've seen them pick up a few good points at home um, they are up against um, who are they up against sorry they are up against Norwich City however and Norwich who beat Watford 4-1 uh, last week Watford crashing down to earth we will talk about them in a minute when we come on to their fixture this is, uh, I think I might have to back Norwich here. Derby County nil, Norwich City 2. And the next match is Blackburn Rovers against Queen's Park Rangers. Blackburn Rovers, let's start off with them. It was a nil-nil draw for them in the... Um... Oh, excuse me. It was a nil-nil draw for them in the um, Lancashire derby against Preston North End. They are up against um, uh, Queen's Park Rangers, who have been quite draw-heavy recently. They drew to Millwall one all, and I feel like I might ba I might back a draw here again, actually. Um... Blackburn Rovers 2, Queen's Park Rangers 2. I'll go for a Desmond. And the next match is Sheffield Wednesday. Sorry. Um, ooh. Who is Sheffield Wednesday playing? I've written down Sheffield Wednesday twice. They're playing West Bromwich Albion. Um, yeah. The next match is Sheffield Wednesday against West Bromwich Albion. Let me just write down West Bromwich Albion here. Because, um, yeah. Well, uh, Sheffield Wednesday. Let's talk about them really quickly first. Uh, Sheffield Wednesday are obviously coming off the back of that 2-1 defeat to Luton Town. And uh, the red card for Sheffield Wednesday certainly didn't help. And uh, um, Sheffield Wednesday have been inconsistent. They need to pick up their thirst. Well, the, they need to pick up that next win soon. Um, they are up against West Bromwich Albion, and it doesn't get much easier for them, in my opinion. West Bromwich Albion, who beat Plymouth Argyle 1-0, and their season so far, the start of their season, has been pretty flawless, in my opinion. Um, I am going to have to lean towards uh, West Bromwich Albion here. Uh, Sheffield United 1, at West Bromwich Albion 3. And the next match is Middlesbrough against Stoke City. 
and I feel like it will be one goal either way. Let's start off by talking about Middlesbrough really quickly. It was a 1-0 defeat for them against Sunderland. And, uh, well, look. Um, Sunderland have been good. Is what I must say. We need to talk about... Who do we need to talk about? Sorry. We need to talk about... Uh, blah, blah, blah. Uh, Stoke City. Uh, and um, in the first match with their new manager, it was a 3-1 defeat against Hull City on the Friday night. And um, I feel like I am going to back Middlesbrough for this one. Middlesbrough 1, Stoke City 0. Do share your thoughts on that one. And the next match is Hull City against Cardiff City. We've already talked about Hull City uh, in that match. They beat Stoke City 3-1 on the Friday night. And we need to talk about um, Cardiff City and Errol Balut, or Errol Balu, however you want to call him, has been sacked. Um, it has been coming at Cardiff City. Uh, they did lose 2-0 to Leeds United. Um, Cardiff City have only scored one goal this season and that one was in the draw they picked up in the Welsh Derby I am going to have to back um, Hull City here but it wasn't surprising if Cardiff City got a new manager bounce and get a point or something pick up a point Hull City 2, Cardiff City 1 and the next match is Watford against Sunderland. The two teams who went 3-for-3 three three unbeaten. Watford's uh, unbeaten run didn't last. Sunderland's didn't either. But Sunderland uh, have looked the better side. And I am going to have to back Sunderland going into this match. Uh, Watford have lost 4-1 to Norwich City. And again, it's a bit of a reality check. It's a bit of a crash down to earth. And I feel like, um, well, look, uh, I, I don't know. Um, for uh, Let's talk about Sunderland really quickly. It was a 1-0 win for them against Middlesbrough. Uh, against, uh, against the Middlesbrough side who you'd be expecting to uh, fight for the playoffs. And I'm going to back Sunderland here, actually. Uh, I've been impressed with Sunderland. Watford 1, Sunderland 2, and the next match is at Millwall against Preston North End, and a match that stinks to me of a 0-0 draw. Uh, Preston North End, let's talk about them first. Um, or actually, who's the home side? Millwall, I think. Yeah, Millwall, um, it was a um, it was a one all draw for them against Queen's Park Rangers, and again, looking at Millwall, they are a bit patchy, they are a bit draw heavy sometimes they can be a bit draw heavy and i feel like it might be a draw today which is why i'm predicting it preston north end however it was an nil nil draw for them against blackburn rovers and yes i did say it stinks of a nil nil draw i am going to back a nil nil draw millwall nil preston north end nil and the next match is um portsmouth against sheffield united and it doesn't get much easier for Portsmouth, does it? Let's be honest. It does get it does get a bit easier for them after this match because they play Stoke City, but they are up against Sheffield United, uh, a newly relegated side. And let's talk about Sheffield United first. Uh, Sheffield United. Well, it was a, a one nil win for them against Derby County, and Derby County it looks like did make things tricky for Sheffield United. Uh, they can always make things tricky for uh, opposition. But um, Sheffield United did manage to get the win, I think. Um, as for Portsmouth, uh, it was um, it was a 2-1 to beat Burnley. And again, Portsmouth did make it tricky for Burnley. But Burnley ran away with it in the end. I am going to have to back Sheffield United. Portsmouth won. Sheffield United 2. And the next match 
is Oxford United against Burnley and Oxford United being at home. Um, I, re I really do like them at home. Um, and uh, I think they will pick up most of their points at home. But they are up against a newly relegated side in Burnley and I feel like I've got to back Burnley here. I'd be a pure idiot if I didn't back Burnley. Let's talk about Oxford United first though, however. Oxford United um uh did uh did lose to Bristol City 2-1 um in the last minute I think it might have been. Um for Burnley it was um a 2-1 win against Portsmouth, and I am going to back Burnley quite heavy, actually. Oxford United 1, Burnley 4. Uh, the next match is um, Leeds United against Coventry City. Leeds United are coming into this match having uh, beaten Cardiff City 2-0, and it was a good win for them. As for... Um, as for Coventry City, well, it was a 2-1 defeat for them against uh, Swansea City. And I am going to have to back Leeds United here. Leeds United 2, Coventry City nil. And the final match, really quickly, is Swansea City against Bristol City. A match that seems to be a draw to me. Um, Swansea, last time out, they beat Coventry City 2-1. And Bristol City beat Oxford United 2-1. I am going to back a draw for this one. Swansea City 1, Bristol City 1. Share your thoughts on that match. Thank you everyone for watching. And um, I'll speak to you all in the next one.